Welcome to Coach's Corner, presented by Conditioned Air. Mike Kelly, joined by the head coach and general manager of the Florida Everblades, Brad Ralph. And the Blades with a 6-4 win last night against the number one team in the South Division, Greenville. What are your thoughts on that game? I liked how we started, obviously. Um, it feels like we're a team that... <clears throat> You know, has improved in a lot of areas. Maybe not not all at the same time like we would like, but um, we had a great start last night. I thought the team came with energy and emotion, and um, it seemed like we had some a couple lines with some chemistry. So a uh, great start. We got on the board with uh, with the goal there to from Sean Jostling, who's um, you know a big piece of our offensive production, and uh, got us off to a good start. And I thought for the most part, the team played well. Yeah, there were six different goal scorers, so you spread around the scoring. Logan Lambden, though, had a goal and an assist, and Andrew Fighton with a goal and an assist as well. A multi-point game there, and he played a feisty game. He did. Um, you know, he really compliments Joe Penenza and Oliver Chow, kind of brings a different dynamic to that line. Um, but, you know, we've been talking about how close we are, and, you know, every all the top teams, we've been 500 or, or playing very close games, and um, just kind of that mindset that, you know, we're, we're tired of it, right? We want to start gaining some traction here. And, um, you know, close isn't good enough for us. And, and I thought last night was a first, a great step in terms of us taking another leap forward and in, in winning hockey games in the right fashion. And then um, the challenge is to bring that consistency back and, and come back with a great effort tonight. Logan Lambden's goal seemed to be the game changer two seconds left in the second period and gave the Everblades a real boost heading into the locker room. Yeah, great play by by Evan Naus. Um, you know, a young guy that came in. We were all thinking he was going to shoot, and then he slid it back toward a Lambo, who who had a great shot. Um, but those goals, when you score at the end of the uh, end of the period, are backbreakers for the opposing team. So uh, that was a big goal for us. And uh, you know, third period got a little hectic. Everblades are three games above the 500 mark. It's the third time this year the Everblades have been three above. How do you get to a season high four over 500? Yeah, well, you know, the division is a, a lot of motivation. Um, you know, everyone keeps winning. It's it's such a, a tough division. Every team, I think all seven teams can win on any given night. So, um, number one, we have to be motivated. Number two, we have to believe that it's not really the X's and O's or the systems or the structure. It's, it's more about the energy, making sure mentally we're dialed in and just playing a game that's uh, from the heart. Who's going to draw the starting assignment tonight in net for the Blades? Uh, Evan Cormier is going to play tonight, Mike. Thanks a lot, Coach. Thank you. You're welcome. That's the head coach and general manager of the Florida Everblades. And coming up soon, it's going to be the opening face-off. The Everblades and the Swamp Rabbits here at Hertz Arena.